What is going on guys, Midi here, and yes, I know I just released a video about the bombardment at the dam and, you know, the radioactive zones. Did I stay in a radioactive zone long enough to find out what would happen? No, I didn't, but a few of you have commented on my video and said, if you fall to your death or you die within this zone, you come back as a zombie. Exactly like the zombie from the Halloween event that you saw. Right now, I can see that loads of people are actually going to these radioactive zones and turning themselves into a zombie. So there is a few things to note about this. The first is if you go to this zone, and you both die like let's say you in duos or quads only i'm pretty sure only one of you can be a zombie i was doing this in duos i turned into a zombie my teammate tried turning into a zombie and we both just died completely so i think only maybe one of you can be a zombie at this point to be a zombie you just need to be in either the prison or the shipwreck radioactive zone and die in any way you want go there fall off a building or just die by the gas you will turn into a zombie if you guys aren't familiar with the halloween event that happened where everyone was basically turning into zombies it is kind of the same thing you're going to have a charge jump ability which just leaps you into the air gets you into the fights or gets you out of fights really quickly next you've got the gas grenade a very important tool for zombies or just anyone in general you've got your rose sweat with the ffar you want to throw your gas grenade down stun them so they can't ads as quick and try and jump on them like that makes for an easy kill if you can place it right next you've got an emp blast which is going to cover a whole kind of circle area like this will go through walls or buildings if you're in the range of someone you're going to know it's going to say you've emp'd someone this kind of messes up the screen a little bit and you can't see your reticle sights on your guns like a mini emp grenade basically if you do die as a zombie you are completely eliminated out you're not going to come back again as a zombie your friend needs to buy you back although the zombies do have like a uav ping kind of similar to the event where you can see one on the map so strategically if you actually wanted to be winning more games one of you could be a zombie and one of you could just be normal and you can basically tell your teammate where people are and bait them out for you kind of similar here rose skin jumps over absolute sweat slipping off him i pop on a few shots with the ump does absolutely nothing then my teammate comes in as a zombie and completely clears them off zombies look a little bit different from before they've blue eyes i've also noticed something weird as well when you start into the game you actually start with a spotter scope which i don't know if this is just for this zombie event or in general but yeah everyone basically now has a spotter scope which you can just use to see people really easy i do recommend putting the thermals on the scopes this is really underestimated and you're going to see people super easy either zombies or players from miles away and i've noticed as well when i got my first kill the skull that comes up in the top right corner doesn't actually count as a kill kill but it comes up as a zombie kill instead i'm not sure if people turn into zombies as well if you kill them as a zombie just be wary for other players because they will take you out pretty quickly as a zombie so don't underestimate them and i did actually spawn as a zombie all the way from shipwrecked and i took a helicopter with my friend all the way to dam and you can in fact interact with the zombie trial machines as a zombie the zombies come up as like a yellow icon instead of a red one normally obviously because you're a zombie as well but you can't damage these i mean i was merely hitting these about five or six times nothing was happening and i was taking damage from them so these are going to attack you just thought that was a cool little note to put in there my theory on this is that it's going to start as an infected zone probably at shipwreck and prison and i reckon it's going to stretch out over this coming week where it'll probably be at hospital next and somewhere else and it will just keep going more and more and more till we basically need to destroy the whole entire map if you're looking to get some easy fast wins straight away use it strategically have one person as a zombie and do this you can't be a zombie in solos you try this you will just die straight away and nothing's going to happen so to become a zombie you are going to need a teammate if your friend is a zombie i did actually test this out if you have enough money to revive them you can buy them back and they will just basically turn back into a human and they're able to land back in the game again and it will say that your teammates got their humanity back in the game so if the circle's kind of ended near the area maybe your teammate doesn't have very good loot or they've just come back from gulag and the circle's pretty small could strategically tell them to go into the radioactive zone die on purpose come back as a zombie and just be your personal uav and a massive distraction i reckon people could win quite a few more games if they're able to play it off smartly with this Although for the Easter egg and where it's actually going, I'm not sure. I feel like this is all in preparation for the next event that's going to come out. You can't loot as zombies and you can't really pick up any weapons or anything like that. I reckon as the weeks go by, more and more is going to get infected and these are just going to appear in more areas. Or maybe the big Easter egg is going to come out and you have to be a zombie or one of you has to be a zombie to, you know, go into these radioactive areas and do something. It started at shipwreck, then prison, then it moved to hospital, downtown TV to dam. I reckon it's kind of going to be the same concept. More of these areas are going to get infected and basically there's just going to be loads of zombies in the map. So get prepared for it. Unlock that new Psychoff pistol and start beasting people. But that was it. That's my little guide on how you can become a zombie, what you can do as them. What do you guys think about this? Are you kind of interested that zombies are getting put into a normal Warzone playlist? Because you can't do this on Plunder right now. This is just in regular. Let me know your thoughts on it, whether it's a good thing or you absolutely hate this and you don't want zombies to be put in a regular Warzone playlist. Let me know. As always, I'll catch you a lot later.